Good evening, YouTubers out there. This is Moody. Hopefully, everybody's doing well. Um, today, we have some um, new work from home jobs um, um, that are hiring right now. Um, these are good paying work from home jobs um, that you may be interested in. Um, I had about four jobs to choose from, but unfortunately, these jobs go very fast. So now we're down to three. Um, the first one we want to cover is um, with a company called, and I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right, but it's called uh, Catasis. And um, what this company does, and I can tell that the the wording on here is very small. So um, later on, once you're done completing the video, just make sure you click on the link and you'll get to my website and then you can just click on each job and then you'll be able to see a little bit more better on your um, computer screen if you can't see on this particular page um, but what they're hiring is for a member engagement supervisor now what CATSIS does is um, they assist patients um, and insurance companies by reducing claim costs by offering patients with behavioral health issues get outpatient therapy rather than going to the emergency room every time there's a situation or staying in the hospital. Um, as a member um, engagement specialist supervisor, your job will be to manage a remote call center, which is going to include about 15 to 20 member outreach specialists um, who reach out to patients who may benefit uh, from the service from um, catasis. Now, um, these calls are going to be mostly outbound calls that your employees will be making. Um, I'm sure there'll be a few inbound calls, but the majority of them are going to be outbound calls. Uh, this is a remote position, so like you said, home office, and all your employees will also be working from home. Um, so what they're looking for is that you have leadership experience. Um, so um, if you have leadership experience managing a team um, and with three to five years of call center supervisor experience or a combination of call center and supervisor experience, you're encouraged to apply. Um, down here it says you got to have a high school diploma. Um, like I mentioned earlier, three to five years of call center or supervisor experience or a combination of supervisor, hands-on call center experience, um, strong management experience, ability to energize and inspire others, and discipline and organize, and you have to be able to work independently and handle multiple tasks. Um, the equipment for this position is going to be provided. Um, I thought I saw on here that they provided like a laptop or something like that. Uh, yeah, I don't uh, could have sworn I saw, but from what I read about this position, the equipment is provided. I may have seen it on Glassdoor or something like that. Um, preferred qualifications are like bilingual English and Spanish if you have it. If you don't still apply um, a bachelor's degree, again, that's preferred, not necessary. Uh, experience with Salesforce or short tail. Um, that's that SaaS software that you probably have heard about that people or companies want experience in. If you have any type of certification or license in healthcare field, that's a plus. And if you have a background in healthcare and wellness, that's a plus. Um, yeah, there it is. Ability to work from home company provided laptop and competitive salary um, holiday sick pay normal stuff and then you get medical dental and vision benefits and a 401k plan which is very cool um, from what I found on Glassdoor um, this position should start off about $19 an hour but that may be more based on your experience um, so again you are current to apply um, again, at the end of this video, you'll see a link to my website where you'll see the jobs listed and everything that I've talked about, and you can click on each link to take you to the website to apply for the position. 
Um, the next position I have listed here is with a company called Phone Burner. Now, Phone Burner, they've been around for about 10 years, so they're not necessarily a startup, but what they do is they offer cloud based software to um, mid size and um, small businesses. Um, to help them follow up with sales leads they may have for their particular business to generate more revenue for their business. Um, as you can see, um, Phone Burner is hiring for a customer support representative. And again, you will work from home. This is a full time um, position, 40 hours a week um, during business hours. Your calls are going to come from, um, and this means calls emails, chats um, are going to come from small businesses, um, so professionals. Uh, so you won't be dealing with their customers. You're going to be dealing directly with the businesses that need a further assistance. Um, and you're going to do technical support. Um, you're going to also help people who are inquiring about this cloud-based software um, over the phone. Um, it does say one thing that's key, anticipate customers' potential needs and determine the appropriate response. So there may be additional applications or products or software that phone burner may um, offer that may be something that this small business needs and if you listen to what they're going through you may be able to offer that in addition um, so like it says develop a deep understanding of the needs of the customer communicate these needs with the management team so that's pretty much what you'll do um, let's see here you must be a great problem solver enjoy problem solving um, with two years experience in customer service or technical support. So if you can walk somebody through on how to do something, and, and I'm sure this company will provide the documentation needed to walk the walk of this business owner through the steps on how to run or operate their cloud software, um, you're in, you know encouraged to apply. Um, again, either two years customer service or technical support. They prefer a college degree, but that's a pre preference. Uh, you don't have to necessarily have it. SAS experience is a plus. You've probably heard me mention in previous um, videos like Salesforce, things of that nature, stack, stuff like that is a plus. Uh, familiarity with CRM systems and practices is a plus. So back to that Salesforce and all that. The Zendesk experience is a must. So you're going to notice a lot of companies that work that hire work from home will mention something about Zendesk, especially if it's a startup. Um, but again, this company has been around for 10 years. Um, they probably deal with a lot of small businesses and startups. Um, I'm going to do a video later on this year about Zendesk and how to learn about that. Um, but again, if you don't have the experience, you could sell yourself and say, hey, I'm willing to learn this application. Um, this is the other experience I have. Um, intercom experience is a must or other chat programs. So like, um, I can't think of it right now, but any time where you work at a job, let's say it's a call center and you're able to chat with maybe your coworkers or management or maybe support or um, those type of programs that they're asking about. It says clearly here that the pay will depend on experience, but ranges from 17 to $20 an hour. So again, good paying jobs. They're not asking for too much. Um, that's what we're going to be talking about today or are talking about today. Um, they have some details they want you to do. To apply, please email the following to jobs at phoneburner.com with the subject line, customer service rep, the date that you're submitting, um, your resume, 
um, cover letter and all that that all must be in the subject line um, and it says one page cover letter that explains why you're interested in this job and why you'd be a great candidate for this position so again if you don't know Zendesk but you know everything else sell yourself with that cover letter cover letter and then your resume now one thing you want to note here it says both should be attached as a PDF file so if you've been applying to other jobs and they're asking for a word doc this particular company wants it to be in a PDF file okay um, and that's enough about phone burner um, the last and final job again I had four but the position like literally posted a couple days ago and they found someone to fill the position very quickly so the last one I have is with a company called Ergion and if I'm pronouncing it incorrectly let me know <clears throat> we'll get a drink of water here one moment so this company Ergion is a startup they've only been around since 2018 and what Ergion Ergion does is <coughs> they match contractors with people who have home improvement projects as a customer support specialist and that's what they're looking for and again you'll be working from home you're going to take inbound calls from customers and leads um, you will field inbound calls um, emails and texts as it says here is your responsibilities provide with return calls with requested information or updates to leads the pay for this position is not um, I couldn't find the pay for this position <coughs> but but um, excuse me who but they say they're very um, <clears throat> very competitive and I imagine that they do pay very well um, what they're asking you to have is at least um, strong communication or customer support um, rapport building skills um, ability to master high-level information for um, products that they may be offering two years experience in customer service and you must speak in English fluency <coughs> um, you must be available for a flexible schedule with possible weekends um, you're gonna work 40 hours per week between 8 a.m. and 8 p.m. Pacific Standard Time they prefer you to have um, customer experience in general labor or inner or construction industry um, experience using a CRM um, customer customer relation management tools like pipe drive talk desk or front I have no idea what these are um, so I'd probably Google them to find out what they are <coughs> and see what CRM programs you've done similar and say hey you know what I've never done pipe drive talk desk or front but this is what I have done and make sure you put that in your cover letter um, and your resume of course so I'm always trying to make sure your resume matches somewhat of what the job is you're applying for because you want everything to kind of match up um, when you're applying for um, these positions especially these startup companies because they want to look at it quickly and they want to make sure that when they're reading they're reading exactly what their company does and what you will be doing or what experience you've had in the past um, to apply for this job you're gonna fill, fill out this form here you are gonna attach your resume your cover letter answer these questions um, looks like there's a small test here about what would you do in a certain situation make sure you read it thoroughly maybe type it somewhere else first and then make sure it's spelled right and all that and then apply it maybe copy paste it here um, it says we'd love to learn more about you please record a one two minute audio to tell us about yourself so you're gonna need to record an audio file 
um, talking about yourself, what you have to offer, things of that nature, and you're going to need to attach that file. So this is different. They want an audio file uh, as a part of the application process. Um, you can bring it from Dropbox or Google Drive or just attach it from your computer, whichever you prefer, and then submit the application. Okay. So again, that's the end of the jobs I have um, right now. Good paying work from home jobs. Um, and if you want to find out more um, work from home jobs, I encourage you to click the link below inside the description where it will give full details on work from home jobs as well as other ways to earn an income on your own terms. All right, my name is Moody and thanks for watching. Now don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Take care now.